my name is Dio Morales, your host of the Gold Squadron podcast. Not the person who was typing to you throughout that break, I'll have you know. We've been had. We, 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 we were hacked. <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully that person behaved themselves. I have no idea what they said. Um, they, were, they were our hype person. They were our <laughs> <laughs> we had a, 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 an inebriated Gold Squadron member. Uh, sit at my keyboard. They know, and they, then and then I walked back. They know Darwin. They know Darwin. Yes, they know Darwin. Darwin Schaefer. Um, yep. So anyway, we have here on stream Matt Carey, Gold Squadron Classic Champion, uh, versus Andrew Goldbach, the champion of my heart today, flying the Dion Morallo card. <laughs> Had to get the namesake on stream. That's right. That's right. They're, they, both these gentlemen are four and one. How about it? Four and one. This is a bubble match, and uh, it's really cool to see Moralo evolve on the stream. Not to mention the, the card. That's just hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> now, we do have those to give away. Not today. I didn't bring any of those for giveaway today. You know what? I could bring up some tomorrow if I remember. That's, that's right. the key, if isn't it? I remember. Cool. If you want them, people got to continue to bug bug me. Okay. Uh, so Matt has brought this Rebel list, Rebel 4 ship, which we see a lot of yeah. on today's tables. Uh, Wedge and Luke, I mean, they're pretty good, right? Yep. Uh, so nothing to see there, just those X-Wings loaded out with the server motor S-Foils. Uh, Dutch Vander accompanying and start the a uh, Partisan Renegade U-Wing. Time starts now. Uh, that Ewing obviously has Leia. Because you can't have a yeah. Rebel Fighter list without Leia. Correct. So Andrew using that, uh, the Boba Fett crew, check this out. He's using Boba Fett crew plus Tobias Beckett to basically place his ship wherever he wants. And here's the thing, Andrew has practiced these openings, which is absolutely awesome. And, yeah, hilarious. Yeah. But obviously effective. Yep. Uh, so Matt comes to us from St. Louis. Uh, what is it, about five, five and a half hour drive to St. Yeah. Louis from Yeah, both here. these guys are from St. Louis. Andrew told me Wisconsin. Oh, Andrew, sorry, you, said, you were saying Matt. Sorry, yes. Yeah. So uh, close by, coming out here, Andrew bringing this scum list. Morello Eval, we've already mentioned, with uh, shenanigans mm -hmm. all up and down. Old Tarok and Cad Solis in the Fang Fighters, which provide some extra punch. So I'll be really interested to see how Andrew flies this. Yeah, I mean, Cad Solis is a Fang Fighter you do not normally see on the stream. I mean, in, in play in general, his ability says that after you execute a maneuver, you may. Um, Gain a red maneuver, you gain two focus tokens. Elusive says when you do a folk, uh, a red maneuver, you get a charge back. So, I mean, it's pretty cool the uh, the action economy you can get there, and I'm really interested to see how Andrew takes advantage of that. Yeah, especially, uh, you know, they have the two talent rolls, they have the K turns. Uh, being able to execute one of those at the exact right time and get modifications is great. It's kind of playing a similar role to what Leia is on the Rebel side, right? Being able to turn yourself around mm -hmm. and still get that action economy. Yep. All right, Morello. I, I really want to see what Morello does, right? Isn't that uh Yeah, I mean, he's, he's either, you know, going to bank towards the bottom of the board edge. Oh, uh, he's got Matt thinking. This is a, it's a, it's a weird opening because there is no good choices. If he turns in on Morello... The fangs are going to be, you know, on his on his backside, and it looks because like right. You could just fly Morello off. You end up on the other side of the board. Yep. And then you fly off again, and now you're behind everyone. Yep. I don't know if that's the plan, but that would be awesome. Yeah, you have you have all the options because you, you can go boop, come out here, whoop, and then come out here. You you have all it, it's. It's crazy. Really, the safest place to be is the middle of the board, which is maybe what Matt is doing. Both yeah, and Matt's, you know, kind of making a line for those Fang Fighters, knowing that uh, if he catches one in all four of these arcs, mm -hmm. he can really put some damage on. 
Yep, so he's uh, passing some target locks out to, uh, out to the bros. And Andrew anticipating the, uh, the, the dash for the center of the board and does not fly off yet. He's going to focus. But that, already kind of getting behind. Yeah, he's already behind and has a 180-degree arc. He's going to be able to get a shot this turn. How about that? Yeah. That's kind of crazy. Round one, he's going to go at Dutch, most likely. That's the thing that's in range. All right, Johnny, one thing we do have to pay attention to this round is my phone because at 8 o'clock we're supposed to have our pizza for our patron uh, pizza party delivered. All right, keep an eye out. All right, how much battery do I have left? 23%. All right, don't text me, people. <laughs> So everyone else can charge their phones here, but you yeah, exactly. But you do not charge your phone here. Correct. I'm just going to go ahead and delete Messenger for now to avoid the problems. Oh, wait. I might have had an important message there. Wait a second. All right, a Rebel Ships just kind of coming up in the middle of the board. Um, trying to get into position, maybe joust or maybe create some distance from Morello. Mm -hmm. uh, and catch these Fang Fighters. So you see the Rebel Ships kind of moving forward some pretty fast, pretty, um, I don't know if I would call it aggressive necessarily, but definitely trying to create some space there from the board edge. Mm hmm Yeah, I like I like Andrew's opening a lot. I really do, because this gives Andrew that that zoom and boom turn next turn. He can five straight into their face next turn if yeah, he wants sure. to. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. And like they have the uh, they have the option to. Uh, all right, he's doing a lock to really just kind of gain gain board information here. <laughs> Locking that rock. So could you explain something to me? Yeah. Do you have to lock something if it's in range? If you, you do. declare lock. You do. You have to lock something. Yes. Is that silly? I mean, it matters for jam effects. In this game, it doesn't actually matter. It matters for okay. jam effects, though. Because nothing here has jam. It matters for jam. So, like, if, if somebody jams you and you haven't done an action yet, it would remove your lock, and then you get to keep your focus for the following turn, for instance. Really? Right, here we go. Yeah. Oh. Hit crit. And two shields. You know what? That's a way to start a game for Andrew. Well, he Morello does have jamming beam, but we'll see if it comes into play. Right. You take it because it's free. And right. you know, like if there's an odd situation where you might be advantageous. But you'd rather just be shooting yep. attack dice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so like you said, um, uh, damage already in this uh, opening engagement and puts Was Andrew just slightly ahead. Yep. Was that range two or range three, the shot to? Because he has outmaneuver. He might have uh, not had enough dice. Let me go ahead and read outmaneuver. Does it have to be a front arc attack? Uh, yeah, I I'm pretty sure it does. So if it was at the side, it doesn't count. Outmaneuver. Yeah, front arc attack. So never mind. Still worked out. <laughs> false at Gold Squadron Podcast. That's why I double checked. What did we say that was false? No, I was I was questioning the outmaneuver. Okay. Oh. False. Fine. False. <laughs> All righty. Uh, so Morello, three turn. Right, just gets right in here.
Yep. Um, who is first player? Do we know that? Um, 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 I think. I think it's Andrew. I think it's Andrew too. We'll wait until next turn to put the token on the screen. Uh, so that maybe that three turn doesn't fit. So people are asking whether or not the uh, alt maneuver works on the YV666. So the front arc symbol simply means the printed triangle lines that are on that. Every ship has a front, that, that front arc shape. So even in the case of the YV, where it has a 180-degree arc, right. it also has a front arc. Correct. All right. So Ewing is banking in, anticipating the speedy... Uh, move here from Cad Solis there at the top. No, sorry, that's Old Terrock. So the question is, but couldn't uh, can the Resistance A Wings use outmaneuver because they're they don't have they're fire, but they're firing. Ah, uh, I guess you're, but they're firing from a turret though, not from a printed arc. Okay, so it, so I guess the question is, why is it different for A-Wings having a turret arc versus the YV having the 180-degree arc? Uh, I guess I can see the argument. True that, true that. All right, focus there. Here comes Cat Solis, nice and fast. I don't know why. I kind of think of Cat Solis being a cowboy. Okay. Zoom. I don't know Cat Solis, the character. I don't either. He's coming in. Boost focus. See if he can uh, nick Wedge, but I think Wedge is probably going to be going to the left. Opening wings. Uh, ooh, oh, now we've moved that asteroid. I think the thought was that he got around the asteroid without uh, overlapping it. Yeah. It was really close, and then he, when he went to go hold it, it moved, so... <laughs> he is ducking out. He called the block. Yeah, still, I mean, not in a great position still, right? Uh, he's giving himself range three behind a rock. He's going to have a focus here. He's the best. He's in a better position yeah, than if that's he had right. been bumped there. That's right. Good point. Yeah, the argument is still uh, fierce in the chat. If the YV can use out maneuver. Yeah, I mean, I as of right now, I, it's round six of the tournament. All right, they're copying and pasting. Well, you know what? Outmaneuver hasn't triggered yet. How about that? Let's let's find well, out. Well, it works one. for jamming beam. It does work for jamming beam. There you go. You're right. It does work for jamming beam. All right, so game is going on. Yep. We're marking a U-wing to measure distance. It's going to be range three. Is it through the rock? 
Uh, no. How many dice? Three dice. He's got a target lock on the force. This is Luke. Who needs it? That is. Spend the focus. Okay. You're right there. Range three uh, with a token helped out. Still going to be taking shots from the U-wing. But morale is up next. Morello on the Y-wing. Range one. Boom. Four damage. Okay, so I guess this is... I guess we have to call it, I guess it, right? we have to call it. All right. So... So lucky. Um, we don't think outmaneuver works on the primary attack for Moralo because he doesn't have a printed front arc. There's something in the FAQ about it. Yes. Could you pause them and check, please? All right, we, we inform the judge he's uh, uh, power walking to the table. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, we'll get this sorted out. All right, we got two judges over there. Talking it over. So you see uh, Matt gesturing <laughs> to make an arc with his hands. That's what's under discussion. So the judges are reading the cards. Yeah. And they'll uh, make a call. Johnny, pizza. Maybe. Takes three there. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so you'll be there soon. Sounds like they'll be here soon. Okay, cool. Sweet. Uh, how soon did they say they're going to be here? I asked them, but he already hung up. So. <laughs> well, wait for them to call again. Just wait for them to call again. All right, so Dutch took three damage there instead of four. All right, so they figured it out. Only works for Jamie Beam. Okay. There we go. Uh, so that's still a lot of damage, though, right? Yeah. Johnny. The one thing I didn't do is, is tip on there. You can tip whatever 15% is of the bill. Just, no, just write it on the check because it's already in the card. Yeah. Just, just sign, it's fine. 15% of whatever's on there. Have some chips. Thanks, man. Uh, 
All righty, let's get this sorted out here. Ulterak has one hole left. One bank. Reinforce the front. All right, so that is a uh, reinforce. Sorry, people talking to me over my shoulder here. 4K. Moves a lock there. Ultra Rock still alive, still can uh, come around here. Got 54 minutes left in the round. Waiting for our next move here. Debating on boost and barrel rolls. Ewing is definitely in a bit of a rough spot. He's debating the boost should get that arc just enough around. And Wedge is going to open those wings. And 4K, because this is the Leia turn. Looks like it fits. No shot there on Wedge. Here's Luke, range two. Reinforce is live. Has a lock. Spends two force. It's gonna reduce one and take two. Two shields down on Morallo. Looks like he has a shot from range three. And 
it looks like hit, hit, crit from downtown. Two dice. It's going to be hit, crit. Fuel leak. It's a blank crit, essentially. Yeah, right there. Range two takes last shield there on Moralo. Two hits, and that's gonna be enough to take Dutch off the table. All right, and the U-Wing, range one. Tom? Uh. No, you're good, you're good. No, it's not to you guys. Have them bring it over here. Yeah. I was going to say, have them bring the pizzas over here and put them on the table. Okay. Yeah. All right. Looking at the options here, the U-Wing is in a good spot to block Moralo. They both got stop maneuvers. Oh, Andrew's probably going to want to gun it for the uh, the board edge soon here, if possible. Right here, we got two two stacks. We can go. You can go around. Just go go around. Uh, yeah. Oh, just just don't trip. We should have dials here pretty soon. Cascade helping us out. It's gonna give us some extra space for our pizza party. Thank you, Johnny. Okay. Yeah. So how much would have been the total? Yeah, okay. Seems right. So, uh, my understanding, I was away grabbing pizzas, yes. but my understanding is no outmaneuver, right? Right, and let's let it go. I, yeah, I, yeah I no outmaneuver, and we're going to let it go. I gather. Because people went a little crazy I gather. in the chat. Let it go. Uh, here you go. Three hard from Cad Solis. He's going to have some shots here onto the U-Wing if he wants it. What happened to Dutch? Dutch gone, man. Who needs who needs out? <laughs> <laughs> who needs out maneuver? He gone. <laughs> I'm sorry.
but all the other ships, all the other rebel ships are doing fine. Yeah. And Alteric's at one. Yeah. He's moving that. All right, so that's Luke taking a lock on old Terok. One forward from the ionization. Clears the stress because ions are blue one straights. And you just focus because that's all you can do. The right number. <laughs> Perfect. All right, spending the target lock. That's three into Old Terok. He gets one evade. It's gonna be hit crit. Console fire. But he's an I five. Oh, was it? It was Wedge that killed him. Ah, it was Wedge that killed him. Ah, uh, right. I was thinking it was Luke. Uh, yeah, that's a whole lot of nothing. Four dice at range one. On to Moralo. Moralo has his choices. But not until after Cat Sola sees his options first. So that is range three. Gets a force back. Just one. Safe. Evaded. I think Moralo probably just goes range one into wedge. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. Oh. That seems good. Wow. Three hits and a crit. All right. Two shields and a crit. what? <laughs> <laughs> a weapons failure. That matters for wedge. Oof. It does. Basically undoing his wedge. Yeah. Wedgedness. And that's half points. Andrew is ahead in this game, even though he lost. Oh, wait, I may, may, let me take that back. Andrew's still ahead in this game. There we go. It's close. Very <laughs> 65, close. 65 58. Uh, Leia status, one charge only. Um, so, Morello. I, it's hard to get these YVs turned around. Yep. So you'll have to take several turns to do it. Um, Morello, do you just do the three turn to get yourself um, to start turning around? I, do you flee for the board edge? I think it's time to flee. Four, so four straight. Four straight. Four straight, four straight. So then the X-Wings should just turn around, or the X-Wings should go for Cad. Uh, yeah, I mean, Cad's in a bad spot right here. Cad's in a, right, okay. So the X-Wing is just uh, one forward, one maybe two forward, yeah. and catch Cad. Yeah. And Morello runs for the hills. <sighs> yeah, because there's no way he's going to get shots. Now, but Andrew, Andrew knows that he needs to keep Morello engaged. So maybe he just tries to get shots on the U-Wing. I think that's probably what he does. You, you oh, probably... turn and get shots on the U-Wing? Yeah. But like is the Ewing even worth it? Coordinate, but you want you need to get stuff off the board. Yeah. Okay. He's stopping. I like it. I like the move. Get in the way of the one and two forwards. All right. We'll see if two Matt bank. read this. Two. Yeah. We'll see what the X wings do. Yep. Well, Wedge does have a focus bump. Yep. All right. right. So taking away the taking away the actions. Though Wedge did get a focus from the coordinate. Chicken range here. Range two. Range two. So two dice only. Weapons failure. Yeah. 
<laughs> Punished. <laughs> uh, you got to choose. He's going to spend. I think he's going to spend. Yep. And one of takes eight. one. Elusive. Oh, 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 wait. Got it. Let me put that hole back. Let me get, give it back. Huh. And that elusive is one use only, right? Uh, well, after you do a red maneuver, you get the charge back. Oh, uh, okay. And using the force there to get three hits. Spend the focus. Takes one more. Cad going into Wedge. Yeah, I like this. Wedge can uh, take some more damage here. Hits hit crit. hit crit. And no tokens on Wedge. That's One gonna of be, eight. That's so going to be a crit. Takes that's a crit. Blinded. That matters for Wedge. Wedge needs modifiers. He needs it. So kind of a, a limping Wedge here. And Wedge, uh, range two here to the U-Wing. Out the side, just a crit. And it's going to take it. Shield. Man, that U-Wing is an enabler, man. You don't want to keep that on the board, especially with having Leia on it, which is uh, charged this turn. OK. Yep. So now we can talk about what the what Morale is going to do. <laughs> uh, I think you, you run. <laughs> I think you got to run think. with both of them. Okay. I think you got to run. Run with so uh, four straight, a five straight. Just get out of there. Right, because the X wings need to turn around. Yep. And they need some space to do that. Mm -hmm. I love the. Uh, the shame card backs here, I know. Andrew Goldback. If you know, you know. And if you don't, you don't. <laughs> this is this. All this, these things are this true. This is what we give you in round six. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> in depth philosophical truths. And that's uh, two bank from the U wing, clear stress. Yeah, I like a three bank for Moralo here. Three to, bank. To the right. Okay. It's going to go ahead and plop a lock. He didn't pop Leia this turn. That gives us some interesting information there. Oh, she's going to the left. Three it works. turn. That works. Still keep shots on. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> what is this new turn technology? This, turn this bus around. Uh, three turn. Okay, so it's we'll see what the X-Wings, again, we'll see what the X-Wings do. Reinforce the back. Five straight. Get out. Get out, Cad. There it is. Uh, looks like a four. No, I, I think that's 4K, baby. 4K. Listen, my name is Cad Solis. I'm getting my charge back. Because I'm Cat Solis. Getting, yeah, we, yep, we gets, got it, buddy. He gets his tokens. Mm. And he recharges Elusive. I like it. I'm better than a defender. Look at me. <laughs> I mean, maybe not quite, but still pretty cool. <laughs> and here we see a K turn. Oh, okay, interesting. He didn't pop the Leia. He's going to go ahead and take the stress. Yeah. Yeah, no actions. Close foils on which? One bank. Ooh, hello. Okay. Um, uh, you, I think he's getting wrecked either way, boys and girls. I mean, barrel roll to the right and forward doesn't do it, right? I don't think so. That's so close. Because that seems to be like a base and a half distance between. And like, Cad is like turned yeah, like just, just enough. a little bit this way. Yeah. Uh, yes, Cad should have a stress token. Barrel roll 
ourselves yeah, we'll away. We'll wait for this to resolve here. Oh, but no, that means no tokens, right? Or yeah, yeah. this is just. So wedge in a bit of Barney. Luke is going to try to finish it here. Elusive is up. Oh, you go for Cad all day. Yeah. Uh, he's got the two focus, right? Yeah, but he, 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 wa he wants to shoot at Cad to avoid losing Wedge. But, I mean, the likeliness that you get all three damage in yeah. is very low. Yeah. Oh, Oof. that's not going to help. Oh, <laughs> let's see what we get. Hit crit. Ooh, wedge. Going into wedge. Wedge, buddy. Oh, oh that is, baby. <laughs> <laughs> that was a hit. Nicely done. <laughs> I was worried. I was so worried for Wedge. Oh my gosh. Uh, so Luke. Could have used the force to try to get a damage in. True. Um, Cad rolled eyeball eyeball. Yep. Or no, um, yeah. Cad rolled eyeball eyeball, so he would have had the focus anyway. Yes. To evade it, so it wouldn't have mattered. But probably you wanted to. You would have wanted to use the force on that shot just to give yourself a chance, right? All right, so Morello's just all about uh, trying to get turned Run back away. around. Yeah, so Dizzy, just three turn again, try to catch someone. Yeah, because if he he might be able to catch Wedge, three turn to the left. Thirty three twenty. 33 minutes and 20 seconds till our pizza party. <laughs> oh, that's right. Luke Luke rolled blanks on his uh, yeah on his attack. Okay. With. Now Leia has not been popped yet. Uh, this could be, yeah, this could be a Leia turn. Yep. Although, no, I guess, or, no? Yes, no? I see a lot of people uh, asking in the chat about the stress token on the YV666. He stopped two turns ago and then did a self bump on a blue move, which is why he's no longer stressed. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Well, he did but, the one bank here, so yeah. <laughs> whatever the whatever case was. Whatever, it worked out. What? He's hiding. He's lost. William's girlfriend's yelling at me. Where's William? I don't know. I I have seen him like for two minutes this whole yeah. event. Barrel roll focus. And ooh, he called he called it? He called it. Oh, does it fit? Oh he got you saw it. You, did you yeah, see the power of fist course. from Andrew? Yes. They both want I mean 
four and one, right? Yeah, this is it, man. Of course. This is for the cut. Of course. And oh, did he get this one too? Oh, no, wait. No. No, that's going to. Hello. <laughs> well, you know what? He only gets three dice, and he can't modify the dice. Oh, he's, Although, oh okay. If you if you flip the action, it's fine. But that means no mods. But yeah, no mods. Four dice, no mods. Looking at two on average. But we know you gotta roll the dice. And one gets one. Got him. Evade. Ugh. And then conquer down face off. Got it. Thank you. Okay, so back at him. Hit, hit, hit. Yeah, spends a focus. Two of eight. Two of eight. Oh. Takes one. Wedge. He's be down to one. Wedge lives. <laughs> Two of eight. He needed both. That's right. And he is out. He needed both of eights. He did. He had no tokens. He got it. My name is Wedge. I ran from the Death Star that one time, but I swear I stayed for the second one. <laughs> he shouldn't have two Death Stars on the side of his X-Wing. My opinion. My opinion. No, okay. Yeah, he, he didn't stay for the first one. You don't get him to get that kill. You don't, like, what do you mean he didn't stay? He didn't stay. He was like, he was like I got some engine damage. I got to get out of here. And Luke was like, go ahead. I got this. Okay. Right? I mean, that's canon. It's canon. There are these hot dice. All Thank right, you, so stream dice, for being hot dice. dice. These dice like drama. How many? But you've got like, you've got like 20 dice. Yeah. So which ones are the good ones? <laughs> that's that's part of the game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, you, dealer's choice, baby. Uh, I wonder if this is a get out of jail turn. You like four straight with Cad while you flee with uh, with Moralo. Um, turn Cad, turn Cad back around. Uh, so Luke did a K turn the previous turn, and then K turned again on the Leia turn, which is why and was and bumped, which is why he's still stressed. Turn around with Cad, get those tokens. <laughs> Should Wedge be stressed? No, it was a Leia turn. He yeah. was unstressed. Talon roll with Leia. Yeah. And the Ewing did a stop and is also not stressed. Yeah. One forward. Basically, just wait, wait and see what's going to happen. Oh uh, yeah, the Leia trigger was not obvious, but um, the way we're reading it and, and the way the tokens were He's flipped, fleeing. he did, uh, he did flip it. Morello evolve. So you, you can do that twice. And that means he can come out uh, anywhere on that side next turn. It's the, um, what is it, the opposite side? How is that? Harder? No, it's on the same side. Anywhere, you come back in on the same side you fled? Yeah. Okay. But anywhere I'm along sure. that side. Yeah. I thought it was like a different side for some no, reason. No, it's the same side. CAD. Three straight. Three straight. Focus. All right, so this is kind of um, a repositioning turn. I don't know if we're really going to get any significant shots no, no, here. No shots this turn. 
Though I guess Wedge could 4K if he really wants to. He did drop, uh, Luke drops the target no, lock there. No, I think Wedge just follows Luke. Forever in his shadow. <laughs> <laughs> I like what somebody said here in the chat. Luke took all the XP for the Death Star. Ah, right. Yeah, and he, yeah that's right. He leveled up. Uh, flips the blinded pilot. So that's weapons failure and blinded pilot are, are gone. Uh, range of three from that Ewing. No, out of range. Scratch that. Where's Morella going to come in? We're jousting, baby. Up and at him. This gives him the most... He wants to get in the spot, probably, that blocks the 4K. But come in close enough where he also kind of blocks the, the one forward. I don't know. That's not really possible. Does, it, does Morella get a maneuver this turn? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So he comes in and gets a maneuver. Yeah. Oh, eagle I know I'm being controversial about the Death Star run to be funny. Nobody. Hashtag Luke is the best. Wedge is the worst. I'm just kidding. Without <laughs> Wedge to save Luke, he would never have been able to do the Death Star run. Do you like what they did with Wedge's character in the Aftermath books? Because he's in, he's in those, right? Yeah. Um... Where he, he gets ch captured on the Death Star? He, like, injures himself. He gets captured. and then But he also kind of like... Doesn't he like Nora? Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry, spo spoilers? for the Yeah, <laughs> aftermath spoilers. For aftermath. Come on. I mean, I think he... This is all pretty early on. <laughs> and this pizza that they... We, got, we, got, we literally have, like, 30-plus boxes of pizza sitting next to us. It smells really good. Yeah, I agree. Can these guys hurry up and and uh, and win or lose? Whatever, they can both win. They both make five and one judges. It's fine. Yeah, we like both of these guys. This is a joke. For those of you who are listening, some people don't know Johnny. Don't know that it's a joke. No, some people won't people know. People take themselves too seriously. Some people, a little too serial. Hey, 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 watch the jokes, watch the jokes, keep it PG, folks. All righty. So two straight, I like it, blocks, that blocks the one forward in the 4K. Blocks them both, and we'll get a shot on Wedge, unless Wedge ran Not away. Not bad, this, yeah, Morello, I need to start flying some Morello. <laughs> <laughs> Who knew? Yeah, I'm really bad at flying Fang Fighters. If I'm being honest, because um, I always they always end up in a bad position, like range two, where they can't do yeah. anything. Um, range two is bad. Just not my style. They're like I just don't get I don't get how to fly them. So, All right. but I like Blue scum. Focus. So like I feel like I I they're like one of the better scum things to fly. Ooh, what? Who what is he doing? It? He went straight. He's like, going I don't, I don't want Morala. I want Cad. I want that boy. Get him. That might be range one. Ooh. He's debating the barrel roll. Ah. Uh, He's like, why get shot? Range one. Yeah. I think it's range one. What do you think? This ain't, the, the, on this side of the board, the, yeah, it's, it's a little always, weird. Hard to, always yep. hard to tell. <laughs> Barrel roll. Into range two, which takes away the Concordon face-off for Cad. Wedge and Silly's. He's he probably disengaging is my guess. Yeah. Smart move here by, by Matt. It's the right move. <clears throat> His wings are currently closed, so he can boost away if he wants to. 
You can boost if you want to. Leave those other ships behind. That's right. I <laughs> got him. <laughs> got him. Um, is he just thinking of repositioning with Wedge? I mean, the, uh, he has a lot of options here. He can three hard this way. He can talent roll this way next turn if he wants to. Like, it's a pretty good place just to be in right now. Maybe yeah. you boost forward. Yeah, but, our, I but think that's, that's foils a straight boost. Are yeah, close, right? He does. Okay. I think he wants to get away from Morello too. That could have been still range three. Yeah. Better be safe than sorry, right? And oh. hit, hit, crit into Cad Solus. He's got three dice. Elusive. Wow. Oh. Ah. Then that's. That's going to be a crit, and that's damage, damage engine. engine. That is bad for those. So bad, bad, bad. That's half points, by the way. Increases difficulty of turns. H of hard turns, yes. Hard turns are white now on the Fang, except for the hard one, which is now red. Two hits going in the loop. Two hits. Oh, loop. Oh. Can't take Luke down. No. Luke, Luke, I know he, you know, he rolled natty dice, but even without the natties, on average, he is, uh... He's just really tanky. So, it's a good ship. All right, so Morello this goes for Wedge. And Cad. I don't know if you can anymore. Like, Wedge is so disengaged, I think you... But so do you turn for the Ewing? Um, yeah, okay, maybe maybe turn this way and try to catch Luke or the Ewing. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. All right, hard two from the U-Wing, anticipating uh, the Trand Ocean Slaver coming in. Yeah. And he's going U-Wing on <laughs> U-Wing on, on Morello. <laughs> Drops the focus token there. And has to do a two bank here in order to clear the stress. If you see him pulling off Stress token or a forward. And does. And you cannot repair damage engine. You cannot repair damage engine. Excuse me. Focus. It's getting in the way. Probably a turn of some kind. Yeah, I see the two turn out. Probably makes it over. Very close. Yeah, yeah, Got it, it does. All day. <laughs> um. So who does Morello shoot here? The Ewing, because it's an easier target, or Luke, because he gets a more valuable target. Uh, but he's. Uh, no, no, he doesn't have a choice now. <laughs> Luke Ark dodges. Epionic asking, Dion, when are we getting another patron level? I'm I'm working on it. I'm working on, on making it something cool. With a cool name. Uh, barrel roll back in. It's opening up that hard two next turn.
All right. Luke on Moralo uses the force. One die has the focus. He probably just takes it. Hit crit. Direct hit. Ah, uh, ouch. So hit crit turns into even worse. Morello down to six. Six hole. And two. Uh, this is into the U wing. Spend it. No, doesn't spend it. Wants no, to. He uh, wants to have that attack. Wants to hurt. Okay. Shields are down on the U wing. He's going back. Three dice. Forgot to roll one. Focus. Gets an evade. Takes two more. Down to four. Uh, yeah, Morello's in a tricky spot here. Um, I don't know. Maybe just three turns up here. The Ewing could try to go for a block, though, right? Yeah. He could also just stop. He could, right. He could he stop. Has, he has Leia but then, available. Like, Luke, oh, oh, the Ewing could stop. Yeah. I thought you were saying the YV could stop. But then you have Luke coming in. Yep. I don't know. He put down that YV dial pretty quickly. He knows what he wants to do. Yeah, Wedge turns in. Luke. Um, Luke just goes slow, I think. Yeah, you one straight. There's That's a, absolutely safest move here. All right, Ewing. One straight. What's the Rebel model? One straight to victory, baby. Looks like it's a turn. Yep, three turn. Arc dodge, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Luke. Cad first. It's a two, but is it a turn or a talon? Eh, it's a hard turn. That's a white turn. Remember, damage engine simply increases the difficulty. They were blue. They become white. Focus. So what was that? Um, you have 12. OK. Uh, checking arcs here. And Luke doesn't want to be there. Nope. So Luke boosts. Yep, he's going to be in Cad's arc. Yeah. But I mean, that looks, he's got the force up. It's very, very little risk. Here's the hard two we talked about last turn for Wedge. He's going to be out of range for any shots. And uh, people asking what was Morallo's uh, action. It was a lock. That's Morallo's lock right there. And this is going to be our last round for the day. I want to say thank you to our sponsor, Curled Paw Creatives. Use that coupon code ADEPTICON19 for 15% off. It's going to be a range two shot on Luke with a focus. And hey, that seems good. Hit, hit, hit crit. crit. Ooh, he's getting at least one. They, all of them. All wow. of them. And that okay. crit's going to stick. And crit goes through. Panic. 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 
that's bad. That's half points on Luke. Oops, too many. That's huge. Yeah, absolutely. That's big. Target lock, spends a focus. This is the U wing. And safe. All right. He's got plenty. Of, he's got time, and Andrew's playing smart, man. Yeah, he's, I think so. Andrew is cold, calm, and collected, man. He is in the zone. Look at that. He slams this he, YV dial down. He knows. He knows. He knows. He knows. He knows. He knows. And really what's going to keep him in this game is how he pay, plays CAD. He wants to be, he wants to use that range one. Ugh. Yeah, that U-wing, though. That U-wing. You know what? I, I taste the three bank. Three bank to the left, trying to throw a block on Cad over there. Huh? Yeah, there you go, man. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Friends of the show stopping by. Saying, I got five and one. That's Justin Brown out of Iowa. It's funny, there are people gathering for the pizza party. You can see them. They keep looking over at the giant stacks of pizza. They can't That's have a lot them. of pizza. It is a lot of pizza. Holy cow. <laughs> Matt's getting a closer look. Yep. Well, what's he thinking about? What, is, what does he want to do with Wedge? Uh, I think he's, let's see. Uh, I think he's looking at at the U-Wing. Yeah, I sure. think he's looking at the U-Wing. Whether or not that three bank gets him in a good blocking position, I really, I really think that's what it is. And here's Leia. Somebody did make a good point. Damage Engine could possibly help yeah. Cad with his ability. And Morales Morello, gone. flee, get out. Disappear. So this is as much a way to protect Morello as to get into better yeah. position. Two straight. He's trying. He's trying to. He's trying to get wedge. He's trying to punk wedge. Come on, come on, wedge. Get in this arc. Yeah, but wedge could just kill him, right? I mean, he could. Barrel roll focus, most likely. Did you hear what Marcel said? No, I didn't hear what he said. He said he was 4-0. He ended 4-2. Oh. <laughs> so, Marcel falls. Uh, one forward here from Wedge. So, Cat is going to take two shots here. Focus. A three on three versus three on three. Whose dice are hotter? He's gonna spend that. All he spent right. that focus, yeah. no doubt. Yeah, he wants. Uh, he wants this ship gone. And uh, he's gonna take evades. one. Takes one. He has to live. And now this partisan renegade can try to finish it off. In a Ooh, moment. Oh, hit hit crit against wedge. Hit hit crit. That's that's probably a dead wedge. He's got to roll natties. Not today. Not One today. Short. So that's a dead wedge. Dead wedge. Oh, this got interesting. Unless we counted wrong. Did we count wrong? No. Okay, we didn't. I got worried for a All second. All right. Now, 
Oh my goodness. Ewing, range. Ewing's got range one. Ewing versus Cat here. Oh. He's looking for Natty's here. It's Neither. range one, so Concord got John. It. Holy got cow. it. Oh, what? wait, what? Con was it range one? Concord Don. Concord Don. Oh, you flipped the other one. Okay. Oh, I thought I saw a, he flipped the other one. All right. Crazy. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> My emotions, Johnny. Oh, what a game. My emotions. What a game. Five minutes to go. Cad's I off think the he's board. Calling it. Okay. That's it. Great game. That was nuts, man. <laughs> <laughs> Matt is laying down on the floor, sprawled out, five and one. Dio, Dio and Morello. <laughs> what is this picture? This was so. Uh, this was after my wisdom teeth surgery. Oh, yeah. Yeah. There's a video. On our YouTube page where my wife interviews me. Right. Uh, go to our Gold Squadron podcast page. Type uh, type uh, wisdom teeth or wisdom tooth or something like that, and uh, it'll pop up. So uh, before we get to the pizza party. We got some giveaways. We got first. some giveaways. All righty. Lightning round giveaways. Yeah, we got places to be and people to feed. All right. So we did our big giveaway already today. We did the Vulture Droid. So we're going to give away some cards. We have the... District Foundry, which is our sponsor of our that. giveaway session. This is going to be tomorrow. Use code ADEPTICON19 uh, to get your own set. You can get custom worded. And again, the coupon code goes up until Tuesday. So make sure, do not delay. Yeah. Don't forget, guys. You, you don't have one. No, I don't even have one. Get it. I don't even got one. I'm going to get myself one. It's going to say Gold Squadron Podcast. Huh? <laughs> All righty. So let's go ahead. And so you know what's round six? Let's give away one of those sweet, sweet poses, yeah? Yeah. Do I have any more? For all of our loyal viewers. Bam. All right. Let's do that. Watching us all day. And then we got to eat. It's eating time. All right. Let's do Hello. that. Hello. How's it going, guys? Pretty good. It's good. We're going to finish this up so we can start eating. You got it. All right. Uh, what are we giving let's away? Let's do two of those. Uh-huh. And uh, we haven't done these. Yeah, we did one. Oh. Let's do another one. Oh, yeah. we did do one. Do I even have the other half? I do. Okay. There we go. And then it's pizza time. It's pizza time. Sounds like it's morphin time. Good one. <laughs> <laughs> Not amused <laughs> at all. All right. What's the first thing, Johnny? Uh, we're giving away two Finch Dallows. Two Finches. All right. So the way to claim your prize is exclamation point win in the chat. There's a link there. Fill out the information. Make sure your address is fully formatted with the spaces and everything uh, to be eligible for your prize. Here we go. First winner in the chat. All you got to do is type three, two, one. Larry Lobler. Congratulations. Congratulations, Larry. Next winner is three, two, one. Isofan. Isofan. You got it. I am Isofan's biggest fan. Of course. Of course. Got to support the team. That's right. Bam. Next up, Nora Wexley. Nora Wexley. Get it. Here we go. Oh, I forgot to type it out. Nora. No, there's two of them, right? Two Noras. Cool. Got it. Here we go. Three, two, one. Roll it. Stevie Knee. Stevie Knee. Congratulations, Nora Congrats. Wexley. Congrats. You get your Nora Wexley. Here we go. Three, two, one. Go. Jared, 40. Congratulations, Jared. Marcel Ford. needed to know if we ate already. <laughs> oh, hold on, guys. Hold on. Let's. Did we eat already? No. <laughs> All right. What? This this goes together, right? Yeah. The PLX. This goes together. All right. Here we go. So here is the PLR set. Here we go. Three, two, one. Roll it. 
the hairy demon. The hairy demon. And last but not least, that frosty. The frosty Poe. Frosty Poe. Last one of the giveaway. Look at that. Look how the light catches that. It's popping. Mm, it's it's hot. Col colors are popping. H A W T hot. There we go. Three, two, one, roll it. Goes to Rabbit Bantha. Congratulations. Rabbit Bantha. Congratulations. All right, everybody. We're going to be back tomorrow. I believe we're starting at the same time, 10 o'clock, with the cut. Stay tuned. If you're not following us on Facebook and all the things, make sure you have all the alerts live so that you know when we for sure going. Uh, sometimes they change things depending on how the number of the cut is. So let's call it 10. And if it's a little bit later, then everybody gets to sleep a little bit more, huh? All right, everybody. Thank you so much. Thank you to our sponsors. Thank you to District Foundry. Again, use that coupon code Adepticon19 for sponsoring our giveaways today. Thank you so much to Curled Paw Creatives. If you haven't get all your cre uh, acrylic needs, you got your new strain tokens. If you haven't got those, get those. Your templates. If you need large tokens, your ARC IDs, all kinds of things. We also got things for Destiny, uh, Legion, all kinds of stuff. <laughs> Dude, you made that such a great game. I, I, I thought I was like, oh, it's just for jamming beam. I thought you were gonna get cheeky with jamming beam, but. Oh no, no, it was totally. I've been using it the whole day. I'm like, yeah. I'm glad I didn't make the cut. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Alrighty. Well, thank you so much to everybody. Thank you. Johnny. Great job today. Yeah, we'll be back tomorrow. We'll be back tomorrow, all day, giving you all the way into the final. Thank you guys so much. Yes, 10 a.m. Central Time. It's pizza party time. And uh, thank you to all of our patrons, our largest group of supporters. If you want to join that group, patreon.com slash gold squadron, you get guaranteed. You know what? Why try to win a raffle yeah. when you can just get this stuff guaranteed? Dion just delivers. sends it out. I just sent, here you go. Mm. Mm. I just sent out a bunch of these plastic pose for people. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. We're going to let you guys go. Gold squadron out.